and this poem was written last year um, towards the middle of the pandemic, uh, thanks to uh, the invitation of the amazing uh, and wonderful Alice Quinn, who invited me to be part of her um, anthology for uh, Corona poems uh, called Together in a Southern, Southern, Southern uh, Strangeness. Um, and this is my uh, Corona diary. In the poem, you will hear me talk, uh, one of the lines refers to a, uh, a folk singer and that folk singer is the singer songwriter, John Prine, who had just died, or was about to die. Corona, sorry, Corona Diary. These days, you want the poem to be a mask, soft veil between what floats invisible, but known in the air. You've just read that there's a singer you love who might be breathing their last and wish the poem could travel unintrusive as poems do from the page to the brain, a fan's medicine. Those of us who are lucky enough to stay indoors with a salary count the days by press conference. For others, there is always the dog and the park, the park and the dog. A relative calls, how you doing? Are you a ghost? The buds emerge on time for their brief duty. The poem longs to be a filter, but in floats spring's insistence. We wait, 